how do you detect when a player dies in Roblox? So when a player resets or when they get killed, how do we detect that? Well, firstly, you'll need a player added event to detect when a player joins. This is all on the server, by the way. However, it should still apply to local script code as well. Then you need a character added event in order to get the player's character. And when you've got the character, you can simply say character added, sorry, you can say character dot humanoid dot died colon connect function. Okay, and then we can print out character has died. And then you can really do whatever you like. Um, if you wanted to, you know, reduce the player's points or whether you wanted to um, put a system message out there, you could do whatever you like, really, because you've got access to the player, you've got access to the character. So that's it, really. Let's go and test it out. We'll go and reset. And you can see it says character has died. And then you might want to check to see if they've spawned again. And since you've got access to the character added, you can print character has spawned. One more time, we'll reset and it's printed character has died and then in a moment it will print character has spawned. Now you might be wondering what's the point of doing this, why will I ever want to know if a player has died? And I wanted to give you a little practical example here. So we'll just create a simple variable for deaths. Now, this isn't designed to be used in a, in a game because you'd have multiple players. This is just assuming you have one player in the game. So when a player dies, you might want to increase the number of deaths by one. And uh, in fact, what you can do is you can just put this variable in the player added like this. So it applies to each player. Uh, and then you could say if deaths is greater than or equal to, let's say three, then perhaps I want to prompt them to purchase more lives. So I could say marketplace service prompt uh, product purchase, you know, and I could obviously put the the relevant information in there for the um, for the for the ID uh, for the for the player. So the game the game pass ID or the product ID, uh, which I don't have to hand at the moment, but you get the idea. Or perhaps you might even want to kick them out of the game, all right? Because you might have an an, an obby where it's like you know three deaths and you die. So we'll just say out of lives. Uh, and so we'll click on play and, and see if it works. So we'll reset once. And I'll just speed this up for you. And twice. Okay, and here it comes, the third death. So uh, yes, it's kicked me from the game. Okay, you can see the physics have stopped. Got the kick message. Uh, in a normal server in Roblox, it would flash up a message saying that I have indeed been kicked. So that's how to detect if a user has died in Roblox. Let me know if it was useful. Subscribe as always, and I'll see you in the next one.